John, 1977. I covered the opening of the circus at Madison Square Garden for Eyewitness News. John, Yoko, and Sean were there with an old friend. That was not Fred Astaire. That's Fred Astaire. No, but that was the real John. Not a beetle, not a star, comfortable, happy. A man with a wife he loved taking their little boy to see his very first circus. How do you like the circus? I see. <laughs> it, he can't say a word, you know. He's got a little board applauding, you know. <laughs> What's your favorite part of the circus? I like the clowns and the little dogs. Would you give it all up to run away and join the circus? Uh, I've already given it up. I haven't decided where to run, though. <laughs> Not long after that, I sat next to John at a Broadway opening of a stage version of Sgt. Pepper. 2,000 flashbulbs must have gone off in his eyes, and I said, I never thought I'd feel sorry for John Lennon. And he laughed and said, nah, that's why I live in New York. People here leave me alone. And every time I walk by the Dakota, where he was murdered, I hear that voice, his voice, say, that's why I live in New York. People here leave me alone.